From the ATD NADA Commercial Truck Guide Headquarters, this is Guidelines Report with Senior Analyst Chris Visser. Retail sales volume recovered from an unusually low June and wholesale volume remains strong. Pricing in both channels was little changed month over month on average. Starting with the retail channel, three-year-old sleeper tractors depreciated 1.3% month over month and 1.5% year over year. These trucks have stabilized in the high $70,000 range for the past two months after depreciating moderately in the first five months of the year. There were notably fewer three-year-old trucks reported sold in the first seven months of 2015 than 2014. Also, the make model supply is well mixed with no single model overly impacting averages. As such, the lower pricing is likely demand driven. On the wholesale side, the number of trucks sold through auction and dealer to dealer channels through July is running 6.6% ahead of the same period of 2014. Dealer to dealer sales were unusually strong in July at 3.3 trucks per rooftop, which is the highest result since December of 2010. Generally, increased dealer to dealer sales suggest a regional realignment of inventory, which can be an early market indicator of a maturing market. Supply is increasing and these trucks are distributed to where demand is greatest. This increased volume has not yet impacted pricing to any great extent. Three and four year old sleeper tractors command pricing similar to last year. Five year old sleepers are running substantially behind, but this is mainly due to the outsized impact of the 2011 International Pro Star on the averages. Demand remains strong for late model sleeper tractors. We should see de increased dealer to dealer activity as trade packages continue to return, but we don't foresee depreciation accelerating beyond our 1 to 2% per month forecast through the end of the year on average. Thanks for watching. Be sure to read the September edition of Guidelines available at www.nada.com/b2b. See you next month.